For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasir.blogspot.com. Thank you. Chapter 8 Similar Triangles Exercise 8.2 Problem 11 Construct a triangle similar to the given triangle ABC with its sides equal to 5 by 3 times of the corresponding sides of the triangle ABC. To draw the similar triangle, first of all, we have to draw a triangle ABC of any measurement. Let ABC is the triangle we draw. Next, we have to draw a ray BX from point B with acute angle along with the BC. According to the given problem, we have to construct a triangle similar to triangle ABC whose sides are 5 by 3 times of the corresponding sides of the triangle ABC. Here 5 by 3 is equal to 1, 1 by 3 means here the scale factor of the required triangle is greater than 1. Then we have to locate the 8 points on ray BX such that B, B1 is equal B1, B2 is equal to and so on up to B7, B8 equal parts starting from B point. After indicating 8 equal parts on BX from point B, we have to join B5 and C and extend BA and BC line segments. Next, we have to place a set square on B5, C as shown in the figure. Next, we have to place the scale as shown in the figure beside the set square. To B5, C, we have to move the set square along with the scale up to point B8. Then we have to join B8 which intersect the B C at point C dash. Next we have to draw a line parallel to AC. Then we have to place a set square on AC as shown in the figure. After this one, next we have to place a scale as shown in the figure which touches the set square. Now we have to move the set square from point C to C dash along the scale and we have to draw a line segment from C dash to A B then which intersect the A B at the point A dash. C dash A dash is the line required which is parallel to A C and A dash B C dash is the similar triangle to the triangle A B C which is 5 by 3 times the corresponding sides of the triangle A B C. Please like, share, subscribe our channel for latest updates by pressing the bell icon. For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com. Thank you.